UNESCO is the biggest organization in the world which is involved in wildlife and nature and the environment. And we've done very, very well here. We are a biosphere reserve, so how nice for us to be part of all of that. We entered the awards because we were persuaded to do so. Um, and because we have so many volunteers, people have, have asked us to get involved and it was very nice to, to win it in the end. But uh, we got involved because we've, I think we've done something a little bit special and people wanted to see that we were recognized for that. It represents all of these people, 12,000 volunteers. They've done some fantastic work and it's not just the 12,000. There's, there's a lot, lot more who are doing their own little bit all the time, even out there today, we don't even know about them. And this is a fantastic thing for every single person. It really does a really good thing for the community and represents what the Isle of Man has achieved. So it was absolutely fantastic to win the award. The Western Civic Community Site's involvement in the UNESCO Biosphere um, shows that we can be part of the biosphere and everyone can be part of the biosphere. We've introduced increased recycling and a green energy, and we use electric vehicles to collect and recycle from the schools. We entered the um, inaugural awards to try and give the staff and the commissioners some recognition so that the whole island could see what we're trying to introduce and what we've done. To win the inaugural Biosphere Award for Energy was fantastic for the site. Um, the general public learned of all the things we've been doing on the site with the increased recycling and the Green Energy Initiative and the staff got good recognition from it. It's a great privilege to be part of the UNESCO Biosphere. Um, it's one of the, it's the only nation in the world and where the whole country is, is part of it and it's really important, it's one of the most important issues of the world at the moment is how we sustain, how we live sustainably. So to be part of this is, is a great privilege. Uh, we entered the Education and Public Awareness part of the um, Biosphere Awards um, and that's because I think everything that we do we try and um, we try and tell people about why we're doing what we're doing. Um, so whether it's in our tourist accommodation with me cooking breakfast or out in our glamping cabins with uh, our eco hot tubs or our heating system, everything we're doing we're trying to tell people more about how we can live sustainably. It's great to win an inaugural award of anything I think, it's a great privilege. We were up against some really good um, competitors so it was a great privilege, including my daughter actually. <laughs> so it was a great privilege to win that, that first ever award. Our involvement in the UNESCO Biosphere is all about respecting the planet and the environment on this beautiful island um, and it's been Flo's ethos from the word go. I was encouraged by friends and family to enter the awards uh, because of everything that we've achieved in Flo and that we needed the recognition for all the hard work we've done over the four years. When we won the award it was a dream come true. It was for us a personal lifetime achievement that we've been recognised for all the hard work that we've done into the biosphere and respecting the environment. I want to encourage uh, people to enter the 2019 UNESCO Biosphere Awards. The categories are Environment, Education and Public Awareness, Energy and Economic Sustainability. The deadline is the 30th of August and it's your opportunity to demonstrate your support for a more sustainable Isle of Man. Music